What's up ladies and gentlemen, Dapper here and we're back playing some more Marble World. Today we're going to be making a cubed marble run. As you can see I have a little cube here and uh, it's a little cube not for long because we're going to make it much bigger as you can see here. That looks about good I think. Uh, we might make it smaller, we might make it bigger, I'm not sure yet. Uh, probably going to change the angles on it as well something like you that way and a few this way <laughs> i want to try to get the maybe the points up towards the top and the bottom kind of like so that looks almost pretty good anyway we're gonna start along here and uh, i'm not really sure how i'm gonna do this yet i want to hit every single part on this cube i kind of wanted to go into a full circle and uh so i don't know if we're gonna like go down here maybe over here back up and then we can hit this side that side and then i think the last side will be over here and somehow make it continue to to keep going around this cube um it'd be really cool if we could get things like this to like spin i don't know that might be way too much of the physics department but anyway let's go ahead and get started i'm gonna move this cube into position and uh well, actually, before we do all that, I am going to leave it just like this. It'll be easy to work on this way. So I'm going to build basically a whole marble run around the cube here. And I do want to see how this looks with a bunch of marbles. Um, something like that. I'm going to put this about here. I'm just going to place a few of these just to see how it looks. One, two, three, four, five, six. Hmm. Do I make it bigger? I might. I might. All right, so I'm just resizing it to see how this would look uh, with eight spawners here. We can do a different color for each spawner. I'm just gonna get this kind of into position here. Okay, so something like that should work. And this might be a little more difficult than I thought it would be. Uh, now that I'm thinking about it. All right, so let me see if I can kind of come up with a way to lay this out. So the marbles will come down here. Maybe they'll turn immediately. Okay, so I've looked at it. I have an idea. I think I'm just gonna go straight across on the very first go. All right, so I'm not planning on making this a race because as I'm looking at this now, all the tracks, <clears throat> I don't think there's any way to get all the tracks to be even. So I think I'm just gonna make the marbles uh, go around the cube and then kind of loop. And then it'd just be kind of cool to look at it from all sides as the marbles are making their way around. I'm also probably gonna have to use boosters and definitely uh, change the gravity on this one. But the first thing I think we're gonna do here, I think we're gonna take a right-handed turn so we can go onto the other face here immediately. And uh, yeah, so like this should be the longest track. It should go all the way down and do an L shape. And then this one will be slightly shorter. And then obviously up in the corner, it's just going to be an L. So, so I'm going to start putting this together now. I don't know if I can do this with snapping, but I'm going to try. Oh, another thing I'm going to do is I'm going to paint the cube so I can see what I'm doing a little bit better. There we go. So far, this is looking good. <laughs> I don't know if this is going to work, but hopefully it looks cool. <laughs> That's what I'm going for. That's all I'm going for. Hoping this thing looks cool. I'm going to keep working on it here. I'm probably going to have to do some custom pieces here in the corner. So I'll do that, that. Okay, so this is taking a little while, but I think I've finally pretty much almost completed it. I need to get the tracks to go all the way to the edge here. And I think I should be able to just copy paste this section and uh, move it to the other sides of the cube. And uh, I honestly don't know if this is going to be the shortest track. And I don't know what happened here here either wait what oh it's just okay it's just hanging off the edge it's a little thick i thought this was like a track piece anyway um so i definitely need to copy paste this over here because we're gonna need a 90 degree angle it uh we can go straight across at the bottom here but then we're gonna have to 90 degree angle and then 90 degree angle again to bring it back to the beginning and uh yeah this is gonna be a lot more work than i thought it'd be but Hopefully it turns out pretty cool in the end. Anyway, I'm gonna keep building this and we'll see what happens. Okay, so this turned out pretty well. I 
think it's good. I might need to go back and cut some things down like that. Marbles will definitely get stuck on there. Uh, this is hopefully going to be trippy. So I don't... Ex so look at this. This this track will actually go down here. It'll come this way and then back down there. And I still... I don't know if that's going to be the same... It should be the same exact length as this because that's just going to do this big L and then it's going to do this tiny turn. Interesting. Okay. Um, I'm going to keep going with this. Uh, I need to make tracks down here now. I think I'll start off and it's really hard to see everything when it's the same color. Hmm. I might have to, to take care of that later. Anyway, I am going to continue this now. Uh, I think I'm going to go straight across. Yeah, I think we have to. I'll go straight across down here. Uh, I honestly can't see anything, so I have no idea. Okay. So here it is. The cube is done. Very, very cool. Um, <laughs> wow. All right. Let me see about painting this just so I can kind of tell what is happening here. Interesting. This might create a pretty cool pattern. Okay, so this is already looking really cool. Although I don't want to individually paint all the rails. All right, I'm going to erase the marbles. Uh, I'm probably going to get rid of... Well, let's just paint the whole thing. Okay, this looks pretty ominous. Like, this looks crazy. Especially with all the, the angles and whatnot. I might need to go back and fix things. But, this looks crazy. Okay, so just to fix a couple little things. Uh, like, I connected these corners here with a couple tiny pieces. Um... I am going to have to move the corners on each side. They are protruding a little bit, but that should be pretty easy. And I think I might go back and connect all these little things. Also, uh, pretty important. Uh, I need to cover these up. So I'm going to need to make, make some decorations like this. Make them pretty big and just to keep the marbles in and uh, cover up each side. And that's probably why I need to close out the corners because I don't want any marbles to jump over off their track. What else do I have to do here? Um, well, obviously a lot of boosters and gravity pads. But so far, this thing looks amazing. I'm thinking about painting it now. But I don't know if I wanted to go back and do anything else. I don't know. I'm just going to paint it now so I can see how it looks. Wow, this looks incredible. That is crazy. I do think I need to put the uh, the cube back inside. And probably going to paint it black here. I need to make sure in the right spot. I think that should do. Yep. All right. That's good. I'm going to paint this black now. There we go. I need to change the size of it slightly. Okay, everything looks good. I need to go back and start fixing things now like this. Uh, I got a little bit of overlap here, which means I'm probably going to need to fix that on every single uh, one that I copy pasted. Okay, I think the next step here is to make this work. 
Okay, so now I'm putting a lid on the top and I need to make sure the marbles can still roll and whatnot. So I'm just trying to get the right height off of it. Uh, that looks to be okay. So I guess that's orange now. I am gonna copy paste this. It is going to be invisible. Let me grab this and we need to put another one on the opposite side. Let me find a good position here to see the height. There's a lot we need to do here. <laughs> uh, I might need to make invisible walls because it seems that the marbles want to go. Unless I can make it closer. Okay, so they're not going up on the walls as much. And I do think I need to cover these up. They are getting stuck. But so far so good, I suppose. There is a lot that needs to be done with this cube yet. And now the cube is going to be harder to work on as well. Oh uh, no. Okay, so we've come a long way, but we still have a, a ways to go here. Um, there's a lot of little stuff I need to do. I need to make all the connectors so that they don't fall out. I need to make sure that the invisible walls uh, aren't stopping the marbles. Apparently I need to... Why does that look weird? Maybe it's not. I don't know. Anyway, and then we got tons of boosters and... because uh, And gravity pads place as well so we can get these uh marbles going all the way around the cube i still don't know how it's gonna look with the marbles going around but hopefully it looks cool uh, i think i just finished up this side i'm gonna go ahead and put this back and i'm just gonna spawn some more marbles just to see how it transitions and that looks really good. Okay. Whew. I think I'm going to start. I need to visualize how this cube is going to be. This is going to be difficult. Um, I guess it doesn't have to be. All right. I think I'm going to tilt it now. And, uh, well, let me just make sure. Okay. I'm getting ahead of myself. I need to finish up the cube. And then is, uh, I need to finish up all, like all the corners and stuff. And then as soon as that done, as soon as that's done, I'm going to tilt it at some type of angle. And there's another one I need to fix too. Here we go. Any more of those corners need to be fixed? Not that I can see. All right. So I need to fix all these corners and then I will tilt it. And then it's time for boosters and gravity pads. And then I might copy paste the whole cube. And we're gonna paint them different colors because this might look cool this might look really cool if we do this kind of a slightly different color scheme maybe we'll see we'll see what happens anyway i'm gonna go ahead and finish this up and then i'm gonna tilt it and then i'm gonna booster and gravity pad and then hopefully after all that it works that would be crazy that would be awesome this thing looks super cool It'd definitely be really cool to see marbles just flowing around it, going the different paths. Um, theoretically, I think all the paths should be the same length, so it could almost be a race. You know, if we if we just watch the beginning and see what marble comes across the line first. Okay, so we might be finally done here. 
Um, I just placed boosters and gravity pads everywhere. I'm spawning the marbles in now. And what's happening? Well, those are stuck for some reason. Uh, we got marbles flying out. That's great. Great. Looking good. Um, <laughs> sure what's happening here. And this should be done, maybe? I don't know. It's pretty cool. <laughs> this is pretty awesome. Marbles are flowing around. Getting stuck here still, though. Oh, they are... Okay, okay. I need to fix this. So I'm going to slide this off a little bit. Uh, they just need a little bit of help with from the boost. Keep going back. Or to go the direction. They're getting like stuck in the corner here. So... A little boost pad there. Does it work? We got some marbles going the opposite direction. A couple of them are getting stuck. No big deal. They are flowing around the cube, though. <laughs> um, I don't know if there's anything I could do about the marbles kind of flying out. Might be able to boost this corner here just to help it out a little bit. So decorations, physics. Have some boosters. Okay, so that helps them out a little bit. And this is pretty much it. So the marbles are just flowing around this crazy cube looking awesome this is this is great this definitely turned out like better than i i had imagined even um i wonder if we can actually just follow a marble can i just slow it down a little bit spawn them in pause it and then grab one of these guys look at this here's a doggo i grab the doggo there we go. And the view is terrible. Nope. So, uh, marble follow, not an option. <laughs> but this is great. Yeah, there is no way I could keep track of a race here. I mean, maybe I can. Maybe I can. Hold on. Wait. This thing is confusing. Okay, so they spawn here. Um, I wonder which track will actually reach here first. So, I'm just going to stay here. Just to see what happens. Oh. Okay. <laughs> so, Magenta won. <laughs> that simple. Wow. Alright, so we got a few marbles getting stuck here. I, you know, I don't even know how to fix that. It's probably just the physics. Oh, those are like stuck on top. I don't know. I think this is as good as it's going to get. This is pretty cool. Um, I might copy paste this. I really want to see this in another color. So I'm going to take this. Copy. Paste. This will probably take a while. Might crash my game too. Oh, this looks kind of sick. Like an obelisk or something. All right. And spawn the marbles. Wow. Yeah. My, uh, my computer's a little laggy. But this still, this looks really cool. Watching all the marbles flow around this cube. I mean, oh, they're getting stuck in some places. Oh, right. I need to open that up. There we go. Now they are flowing. This looks crazy. Wow. Okay. It's pretty cool. Pretty cool. What else could we, can we give this a even better color scheme though? All right, what if I just grab this whole thing? Up the marble amount to one, so I can save some frames here. Uh, I set this marble amount to one as well. Uh, I'm gonna copy paste this whole thing again, and let's see if we can find some better colors. Okay, so I have an idea to kind of make this look like a tech cube in a way. Um, so I guess I'll do like ten marbles and make the trails red. Uh, I should also... Actually, let's make this one. One marble, and we'll make the marbles red as well. Oh, one of these... Okay, so this is still spawning a ton of marbles. Okay, <laughs> now... Now this looks really cool. Oh, I need to open it up. Whoa! 
spawn a couple more waves here till it looks pretty insane look at that that looks awesome and we're not losing any wow that is super neat <laughs> okay we've lost one but that is fun look at this this is so cool yeah this is like a like an tech obelisk something or other i don't know look at this this looks cool too just having them different colors going around dang this this is awesome this looks like a like a some kind of alien obelisk or something <laughs> super cool uh i still have a few marbles getting stuck but it looks like the other marbles kind of help them out um i wonder if i can make this look a little bit crazier maybe a couple more waves here uh i think i can only get like a hundred um trails at a time but that looks so cool okay what if i i guess i can change the trails a little bit here all right i think i'm gonna do rainbow last that's probably gonna look pretty darn cool i'll do rainbow keep the marbles red see what happens turn the speed up okay that's pretty neat Anyway, hopefully you guys enjoyed today's episode. If you did, be sure to smash that like button. If you want to see more things like this in the future, don't forget to hit the subscribe. And I will see you all in the next one. Peace.